Hey guys! So, this is my first speaking video, and I have to admit it's a little awkward just talking to a camera, but I'll get used to it. So, today I'm going to do an unboxing video. I got um, the Anastasia Modern Renaissance palette. I'm so excited to open it because I haven't yet, and I see pictures of it everywhere, and I'm so I also have here a package from Static Nails, which is a like press on nail company, and um, Laura May Beauty, which is another cosmetic company. Um, so I will start with Anastasia. It comes with some bubble wrap, but don't care about that. So here is the palette. Oh, I'm so excited to open it. Okay, so it's kind of like a pretty like blush lilac color. Oh, it's fuzzy. I've read about that. Ooh, my first impression is kind of, it looks bigger than the other ones, um, but I love it. I really like the pinkies and then the neutrals on this side. I think I'm going to really love this palette. <laughs> I have the World Traveler palette and the Self Made palette. And I love the World Traveler palette because it's more like neutrals and kind of the orangey warm tones. and. The self-made one's a little more cool and pink and sparkly and shimmery. I'm more, I mean I like that too, but I like the warm colors and I like that this is kind of a marriage of both. So. <laughs> These ones look so pretty. I love that like magenta color. I'm really excited. That's all I got from Anastasia was this. So, next is Static Nails, which this one I have already opened because I actually got three of them in the mail. Like three of them in this package. And I've already been wearing one like crazy. Um, if you look at my Instagram, I have lots of pictures with them. They're marble, they're white and they're marble. And you can, the great thing about these is that you can shape them however you want. So you can file them. The ones that I, I kind of made them like that um, princess shape. So it's like they're like a claw, but the point is cut off. Um, I love that shape. So if you go to my Instagram, I made a blue beauty. Then you can see some pictures there. But I also got, besides the marble ones, I got the Firemen, which are kind of like Louboutin heels. Um, they're nude on top. And then they come in this cute little pouch. They're nude on top and then they're red underneath. So they come with 14, I think, 24 nails. But yeah, it comes with 24 nails all together. So you get one full pair and then you get 14 backup ones, which is really nice. Um, but these ones you can kind of see are, oh no, I'm losing them all. Good thing I have backups. <laughs> um, you can see that they are really, really long, but you can file them to whatever length you want them, which is really nice. Kind of appeals to everyone. I have the fireman, I have the marble, and then I got just plain white ones. Because you can paint the white ones whatever color you want. You can paint them, you can keep them white. You can actually take the polish off of them too. I made sure to read all about it before I ordered them. Um, you can take the polish off, you can repaint them whatever color you want. It's really nice. So I, I work at Starbucks, so we can't have anything on our nails. You can't have polish, you can't have acrylics, because I love acrylics, if I could have them I would. Um, but you can't even have them polished. So these are really helpful if you work somewhere where you can't have acrylic nails or something that you have to kind of commit to. These are nice because they, the glue, I swear, they stay on forever. You can, there's directions inside, but you can put like extra glue for them to last longer. If you just want to wear them for one day, you can put less glue and they come off really easily. All you have to do is like soak them in hot water and they come off really easily. So it's really cute. They actually, they have little quotes on the back of them too. That's cute. This one says, walk like you have three men walking behind you, Oscar de la Renta. And this one is, beauty begins at the moment you decide to be yourself, Coco Chanel. So these are the white ones. These ones are pretty long too. Ah, eh, they're not as long as the other ones. The other ones are stiletto length. I don't think these ones say. But it comes with all sizes. They're really nice. Um, these ones are just the regular white ones. So I would probably... <sighs> China Glaze has a color, which I, don't, I haven't seen it any time recently, but a couple of summers ago, it was my favorite nail polish color when I had acrylics. It was... It was called You Drive Me Coconuts, and it was this bright, hot pink. And I wish I could find it, or if anybody knows a dupe or anything that's similar to it, I would love to know. Or if you know where to find it, because I haven't seen it on China Glaze, I haven't seen it at Sally's, I haven't even seen it at my nail salon that I used to go to. So, if you have any word, 
please let me know. I have static nails, I have the Modern Renaissance, and then the last package is from Allura May Beauty, which I never, I saw them on Instagram, and I really, they have like liquid lipsticks and eyelashes, and I think they have other stuff too, but that's all I ordered were liquid lipsticks and eyelashes. My favorites. So, let's see. They come in this cute pink package. Um, some bubble wrap. Ooh, these are so cute. Okay, these are the eyelashes. I got two pairs of eyelashes. I got Au Natural and Starstruck. So, and we'll do close-ups on all of them. Um, but they are, I believe they're mink or silk. Let's see. I could be wrong. They're 100% mink. So they are mink lashes. These are Au Natural. They're really pretty. They look really wispy. Those are my favorite kind of lashes. Um, and these are starstruck. The ones, ugh, they had like the perfect, because my favorite ones are, are Dell, like my favorite fake eyelashes are Dell nat Natural Wispies. Oh, I'm sorry. Um, my favorite eyelashes are Ardell Double Wispies. And they had ones that looked really, really similar online, but they were sold out. So this is the style. Oh, natural. This is starstruck. These ones are really pretty. They look a little shorter than Oh Naturel, but I could be wrong. They look really wearable. Um, and then I got four liquid lipsticks as well. I got Bahamas, Spain, Cashmere, and Agra. Oh my god, my, my sticky boobs just fell off. So. It's great. I'm sweating. I'm sweating. Oh. I'm going to do swatches of all of them too. So, I don't know how to do this. This is Agra. It's a pink, it's like a pinky nude. I feel like it reminds me of Lovely by Anastasia Beverly Hills. That is one of my favorite, favorite lip colors because it's just so wearable. You can literally wear it with anything. It's kind of thin, but it's really buildable. I think it smells really good too. So that's, that's a plus. Okay, this is okay Spain, which is kind of a deep berry color. I feel like it'd be really pretty in the fall. It's really nice, it's really buildable. It's kind of thin, like it's going on kind of thin here, but I think that'll be really nice on the actual lips. This is the color Bahamas. It's a kind of a pinky, magenta y coral. This is like my favorite kind of color, like lip color. It's this pinky color. This is cashmere. It's kind of a more orangey nude. It's really dark in the bottle. Ooh, it is really dark. Well, that's a nice nude. That's a nice, like, brownie. Kind of like a pinky undertone nude. This is Agra, the first one. Agra. And then we have Spain. I feel like this one could use another coat. But it's nice that you can use it lighter, too, because it's so dark. Uh, Spain, it reminds me of um, Craft by Anastasia. Bahamas here, this pinky magenta color. Almost looks kind of peachy in the viewfinder. And this is cashmere. And this is a brownie nude. Okay, so that's everything. Just to recap, the Modern Renaissance palette, I love this color. It's just so feminine. Pretty. Very pretty. But so yeah, Allure May is not as well known of a brand, but I'm really impressed with, I mean, I just tried to scrub off the uh, little samples or the little swatches and they didn't come off very easily. So, I'm really excited to try all of these. Um, the lashes look really nice too. Oh, here's a nail on the ground. Okay. Did I drop the other pair? <laughs> I really recommend checking out Laura May. Laura May Beauty. These are them. They have lashes too. It's just at Laura May Beauty on Instagram. Check them out. Check out my Instagram. I'm, I'm sure I'll be posting pictures soon now that I've opened everything. I'm very excited to try it. Static nails. I also have them tagged on all my pictures that I have nails on Instagram. So I also have those marble nails on an Instagram pictures. Check out my Instagram at Amanda Bloom Beauty. Um, see some pictures of me. Thanks to Lindsay Marie for letting me use her background. I'm house sitting for her this weekend while she's at VidCon. Um, check out her channel. She's the one that really motivated me to start a YouTube channel. So I owe a lot of this to her. Thanks, Lindsay. Um, but yeah, so thanks for watching and hopefully I'll be making some more videos like this soon. Bye! And blur!